I'm Richard Orton. I'm a meteorologist for the ABC affiliate in Denver, Colorado, just outside of Boulder. And I'm also an alumnus of the University of Colorado. If you're choosing a college, you know it's a very important decision. Where are you going to go? And I would encourage you to choose the right place based on not only the academics, but also the weather. Colorado avalanches, well, you probably think that Denver is buried in snow, and therefore, why would you want to go to the University of Colorado? Well, that's just not the case. Yes, it does snow, but our snowstorms typically are fast movers. We start to cloud up, the snow moves in, and then you're blanketed in the white gold around the area. We clear up, giving us plenty of opportunity to melt that snow off and warm up so that you can get back to class. But the good thing about the snow is that we get about 300 to 400 inches a year in Colorado's playgrounds, the Rocky Mountains. So that's where you want to be when you're not hitting the book. So with that in mind and the beautiful sky conditions that we see, whether it's a sunrise or a sunset or just the extreme weather we can see as well, this is a good place to be and a good place for you to go to school. Our average temperatures during the summertime and the afternoon are in the 80s. Our morning lows tend to be in the 50s. And during the wintertime, when you're in class, 50s and the 20s. And our average snowfall, we generally get about 60 inches around town. In the high country, they could see anywhere from 300 to 400 inches. That's great for you skiers. And in terms of the average sunshine year-round, we get tons. So keep that in mind when you plan on where you're going to college. And make sure it's CU Boulder.